Hey guys, it's Brandon Miniman from PocketNow.com, and this is the unboxing video of the LG Insight on the AT&T network. This is LG's first smartphone in the U.S., and it's going to be going up against the Epix and the, uh, the Fuse and other new Windows mobile phones that have hit the AT&T network for the holiday season. So let's take a look. It's a slab device, kind of like the Omnia. Let's see what we have on the box here. International multiband roaming, email capable, GPS, camera phone. Some specifications. All right, well, let's get inside the box. Getting a started guide. We'll take a look at the phone in a minute. Here's the battery, and let's see how big the battery is. It is of size 1300 milliamp hours. Good size for a phone like this. Here we have what looks like the same little dongle that comes on the Samsung Omnia. I hope this isn't the stylus. Yeah, it is the stylus, which tells me that the Insight probably doesn't have a stylus actually attached to the device. You have to carry this around, which is kind of annoying. Um, let's see what we have here. We have a charging cable, and it looks like it uses micro USB, which is better than nothing. I mean, it's not mini USB, but uh, it's not it's not the best. And here we have the charging adapter, and then we have some software, and what else do we have in the box here? And just an accessories guide. Okay, so let's take a look at the device. And it's got a lot of plastic on it. So let me start by peeling some of that off. It feels kind of big in hand. It's got a really interesting shape. Um, let's see what it says on the screen. The LG Insight uses a LG Quick Access menu. Uh, see the setup guide, see the online tutorial, things like that. Okay, so let's take off some of this blue. Um, let's look at how it compares to other devices like the Omnia, which is very similar in terms of resolution and um, even screen size. In terms of thickness, looks like the Insight is a little bit bigger. And let's look at the Touch HD, which of course has a much, much, much larger screen. And is a little bit thinner as well. And let's look at the, the Epix, which I know a lot of people are looking at right now on AT&T. So it is um, not as tall as the Epix. It's much smaller in hand. And it is probably about the same thickness. And let's look at the iPhone just to finish up the comparisons here. and a little thicker than the iPhone. So my, my first impressions of the device is that it feels high quality, it looks great. Um, it's a really interesting uh, look for a Windows mobile device and I look forward to testing it more. Be sure to follow us on Twitter at twitter.com slash pocketnowtweets and we'll be back very soon with a lot more coverage on the new LG Insight on the AT&T network.